Well, from misery to controversy, but should it be? Tonight, you all decide. I will lay out for you the latest storm following Congresswoman Ilhan Omar and ask you, is she deserving of this latest attack or is she at this point being unfairly targeted? It began as many controversies do these days. Online, on Monday, a man named Mohammed Tawidi hit send on a tweet saying this, quote, Ilhan Omar mentions 9-11 and does not consider it a terrorist attack on the USA by terrorists. Instead, she refers to it as some people did something. Okay, that's his tweet, and it lights a fire. It gets tens of thousands of retweets. By yesterday morning, Fox & Friends hosts hold a discussion on their show about those four words Congresswoman Omar said. The four words being, some people did something. Host Brian Kilmeade said this about those words. Really? There's so few people did something? You have to wonder if she's an American first. By last night, reactions coming in from all around, from Republican higher-ups, like the GOP chairwoman, calling Omar anti-American. By Democratic Senator Tina Smith, she tweeted that Fox & Friends questioning Omar's patriotism is dangerous. And then by Congresswoman Omar herself on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. When yeah. people say, you know, that um, because I, I, I'm a Muslim, I'm an immigrant, I'm a refugee, mm -hmm. that I can't have any loyalty to our country. I took an oath. I took an oath to uphold the Constitution. I am as American as everyone else is. This morning, the New York Post, owned also by Fox News owner Rupert Murdoch, released this cover, clearly rebuking Omar. Those are the reactions, but now let's talk about what the reactions are to, so you all can decide for yourselves. That first tweet on Monday from Tawidi that points to Omar saying some people did something when she was speaking about 9-11. Omar said those words 19 days ago at an event for CARE, the Council on American-Islamic Relations in Los Angeles. But it's controversial now, and at issue, again, those four words. Here's the clip of the Congresswoman saying it so you can see it for yourself. CARE was founded after 9-11 because they recognized that some people did something and that all of us were starting to lose access to our civil liberties. One issue of fact, CARE was founded in 1994, not after 9-11. Omar's spokesman, Jeremy Slevin, said Omar misspoke and meant to refer to the fact that CARE had doubled in size after the September 11th attacks. But that last part. Some people did something and that all of us were starting to lose access to our civil liberties. That's what Omar is being attacked for by some. Those some say she should have said terrorists killed and not some people did something. But... If you listen to Omar's entire speech, it's 20 minutes long. Others say she was trying to talk about how Islamophobia became worse after 9-11. How because some people who identify as Muslim attacked America, all Muslims were being unfairly targeted in America. Like I said at the top, everybody gets to decide how they feel. I truly believe that. But I also know this is true for all people. Context matters. So take a look at her entire speech if you have the time so you can see it all in its original context.